Hello, I am Keith Miller, and I am here at Senator Joyce Fairbairn, and I'm going to be talking to you about our Fine Arts Festival. So the Fine Arts Festival is something that's really exciting. It was something that was started when the school first opened, and it was meant to be a showcase of every single fine arts skill imaginable that our students might actually have, from dancing to singing to music to multimedia to art. We wanted to be able to give, give our students a chance to show off all of these things that, that maybe they don't always get to do. Um, and it's really exciting. This year, we've really trimmed it down. We've, we've made it very student-driven in hopes that uh, the students kind of really, really buy in. So kids who are having piano lessons outside of class, kids who have saxophone lessons or dance lessons, they're coming up with things that they've already prepared for and they've submitted it just like you would at a fine arts festival. They're coming in and we're gonna be setting up the school as if it's a, a street festival. Our students are gonna be around busking, they'll have their music cases open, and uh, if you want to drop in some change, by all means, we'll take all donations for our fine arts program. And it's gonna be really neat um, because it's, it's a little bit less um, this early on in the year. It's a little bit more low key, less pressure on some of these kids. Um, with more and more opportunities coming about later. We then have an actual program where everyone who is involved and who can does a nice dance number. We've got our band playing. We've got different uh, art classes or drama classes who are also going to be submitting um, pieces for a little bit of a, a prepared program. And when it's all said and done, it's a fun little hour and a half night that uh, I'm really proud of our kids for, for putting together. And I hope you're able to come and see because I think we have a little bit of everything. So it starts on November 29th at 6.30, the doors open for you to come in and see all of the buskers. All of our street performers, our students are situated around the school just playing their own little pieces that they've prepared. And then the actual prepared number starts at seven o'clock. So if you're kind of stretching that dinner time, you can make it here for maybe that 6.50, seven o'clock mark to get the actual full program. Um, tickets can be bought student cash online, so you could go to our website and just search right in the search bar there for student cash online, or you can buy tickets at the door for $5.25. And don't think that we're going to be ending with our Fine Arts Festival. This is only the beginning. After we're done with this, we're hoping that the taste for Fine Arts is going to be even bigger at our school as we go and have our musical performance in April, Legally Blonde Junior, the musical, and then again, we're going to be doing our uh, film festival in April, where you'll actually be able to see the sequel to our movie that we did last year, After School Thriller. We hope to see you at all of these events. Thanks.